of entire days with thanksgiving in my heart. Glory, glory, glory to God. This is the day that the Lord has made. I will rejoice for he has made me glad. He has made me glad. He has made me glad. I will rejoice for he has made me glad. He has made me glad, he has made me glad. I will rejoice for he has made me glad. I will enter his courts with thanksgiving in my heart. This is the day that the Lord has made. I will rejoice for he has made me glad. He has made me glad. He has made me glad. I will rejoice for he has made me glad. Glory to God. What a mighty God we serve. Angels bow before him. Heaven and earth adores him. What a mighty God we serve. This is the day, this is the day, this is the day that the Lord has made, that the Lord has made. I will rejoice, I will rejoice and be glad in it, and be glad in it. This is the day that the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. This is the day, this is the day that the Lord has made. Look what Jesus did when he washed me, when he washed me, when he washed me. Look what Jesus did when he washed me, when he washed me in the blood of the Lamb, I'm safe, and I know that I am. I'm safe, and I know that I am. I'm safe, and I know that I am. Jesus washed me in the blood of the Lamb. Look what Jesus did when he washed me, when he washed me, when he washed me. Look what Jesus did when he washed me, when he washed me in the blood of the Lamb. I'm saved, and I know that I am. I'm saved, and I know that I am. I'm saved, and I know that I am. Jesus washed me in the blood of the Lamb. Look what Jesus did when he washed me, when he washed me, when he washed me. Look what Jesus did when he washed me, when he washed me in the blood of the Lamb. I'm saved, and I know that I am. I'm safe, and I know that I am. I'm safe, and I know that I am. Jesus washed me in the blood of the Lamb. Glory to God, glory to God, glory to God, glory to God. Mama, 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 Lord is sweet. Mama, 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 Lord is sweet. My Lord is sweet, my Lord is sweet, my Lord is sweet, my Lord is sweet, my Lord is sweet. My Lord is sweet, my Lord is sweet, my Lord is sweet, my Lord is sweet, my Lord is sweet. Hallelujah. Glory to God in the eyes. What a mighty God we serve. Angels bow before him. Heaven and earth adores him. What a mighty God we serve. Isn't the love of Jesus something wonderful, something wonderful? Isn't the love of Jesus something wonderful? Praise his holy name. Glory to God. Glory to God. Isn't the love of Jesus something wonderful? When you think of the love of Jesus, 
and his goodness towards you. Isn't he a good God? Isn't he awesome? Isn't he holy? Isn't he worthy? Isn't he omnipotent? When you think of his goodness, his beauty, glory to God, his grace. Oh my God, Jesus. Oh my, what a mighty God we serve. Angels bow before him. Heaven and earth adores him. What a mighty God we serve. Oh, glory to God. We give the name of the Lord a praise. Shall we praise the name of the Lord? Shall we praise the name of the Lord? Shall we praise the name of the Lord? Blessings and honor, glory and power be unto him. Oh, God, all glory. Hallelujah. All power. Glory to God. There's none like him, and there'll never be none like him. Glory to God. The songwriter said, we search all over. We could find nobody. Oh, glory to God. And we know that scripture says that. Oh, God, when he look, oh, God, he couldn't find. There's none to compare to him. Oh, glory to God. He's God all by himself. He's self-existent. Oh, God, he exists. Oh, God, in his glory and his splendor of his majesty and his power, mighty God. Angels bow, oh God, because of how good he is. Hey God, because of how mighty he is, because of the he is the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, the conquering line, the tribe of Judah. Hey, Baba Seke. We bless you, Jesus. We give you honor. We give you praise. We give you thanks. We give you glory. Uh, God, and we give you power. We thank you for your goodness. We thank you for your provision. We thank you for your protection. We thank you for your guidance. We thank you for your peace. Oh, God, we thank you for your stability. We thank you, God for creating us in your image and in your likeness. Oh God, we thank you that you have given us the strength and the power. We thank you that, Lord God, we can lift up our heads. Oh God, to give you the praise, to give you the glory and the honor. We thank you that our hands can lift up. We thank you. We thank you that you teach our hands, oh God, to, 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 to warn our fingers to fight. Hey, God. Oh, God, we thank you, God, that you allow your angels to encamp run about us. Oh, God, we thank you that you're interceding for us. Oh, God, we thank you that you're praying for us. We thank you that you never lost a battle. We thank you that you're the God who sit high and you rule low. Oh, glory to God. You rule in our fears. We thank you that you, God... Oh, God, that you came among us. We thank you, God, that you live inside of us. We thank you, God, that there's no one that can take your place. We thank you that there's no one that can take your power. We thank you that you're holy. We thank you that you're righteous. We thank you that you are God. We thank you that you are good. We thank you that your mercies, oh, God, that it flows to us. Oh, Jesus, every day, new mercies I see. Maba Sheke, we thank you, Lord, that you have equipped us that you have called us and Lord God, you have ordained us. Oh God, you have elected us, you have selected us, you have chosen us. Oh God, for us to keep on going. Don't stop, don't give up. Mighty God, we bless your name. You are holy. Oh God, the great God, our God, the mighty God, the righteous one. We, Oh God, when we run in, we are saved. Oh God, you hide us in your pavilion. You cover us with your feathers. Jesus, you made of every crooked path straight. Oh God, you are God. Right now, God, as we come before you, oh God, we ask you, God, to take over the airway. Oh God, we come against every demonic forces, every fly forces, every ant forces. Oh God, every seal, every serpent. Oh God, every scorpion, mighty God, every lion. Oh God, every dragon, every beast. Oh Jesus, I'm not everything that creep, everything that crawl, eh, Shanda, we Karabasia. We know that you are holy. We know that you are righteous. We know that all power is in you. Oh God, and with your power and your authority. Oh God, that you have bestowed 
and us and tell us to do go in the world oh jesus to be witnesses to be to great export greater is your power that is in us than the things that are in the world that will come up against us oh jesus it's through you god we are going to run through the troops we're going to leap over the walls it's through you god we can keep up with the foot oh god man and the earth man oh god give us the strength give us the tenacity oh god give us the courage oh god give us lord jesus tactics and strategies in this time of warfare and battles help our highs oh god not to get timid of what we see and our ears not to shut down because of what we hear because lord god this is your day oh god this is your time this is your season oh god when we are in this time and we are in the season where lord god oh god is wickedness in high places but we know that the weapon of our warfare that they are not carnal but god they are mighty through you god through the pulling down of stronghold yea god they are mighty through you you baba shaky and we got through you god We'll be able to do great exploit through you, God. Hey, Baba Seko. Oh, God, you give us, oh, God, oh, God, the strength. Give us, Lord God, the hands. Hey, Shanda, help our feet, Lord God, to run and not get weary. Help our mouth, oh, God, to proclaim your truth. Jesus, you are holy and you are righteous. There's none like you. Oh, Baba Seko, we give you praise, we give you glory. Oh God, anoint, uplift, lift up a standard. Oh God, touch your people. Oh God, give them the strength, give them the energy. Oh God, oh God, let them, oh God, to keep on going. Oh God, let them to keep on going. Let your angel encamp run about them. Strengthen them, Lord. Strengthen them, Lord Jesus, for a time as this. Yeah, God. Strength, eh, ba ba ba, shake Strength, Lord, e ketele bo shata, e la ba siai, and let your will, oh God, continue to manifest in their life. In Jesus' name, glory to God. Jesus never fails. Jesus. Never fail, ever and shall pass away. But Jesus never fails. Jesus never fails. Jesus never fails, ever and earth will pass away, but Jesus never fails, hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Hallelujah. He never fails. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Jesus never fails. God, we thank you for your word right now, which we're going to, you're going to speak to your people. We pray, God, that their ears will be open to hear. Their heart will be open to receive. Oh, God, that everything that of me, God, be subjected to your power. Oh God, breathe afresh. Oh God, restore. Let no man, Lord God, said, Lord God, because, oh God, of their strength. But God is not because of my strength, but it's because of your strength. Mm. It is because, God, of your God, oh God, hands that have lifted me up. Out of the many waters. Oh, Baba Siko. It's because of your strength. Oh, God, it's because of your peace. Ikaturia Sekandosha. Ikaba Sekora. It's because of you, God. So, God, I pray that your strength, that your power, that your knowledge, that your understanding, that your wisdom, oh, God, will be God. Oh, Jesus, in me. Baba Sheko. And, Lord God, you 
your will will be done through me right now in no other name but in the name of Jesus. Yea, God, we won't belong. Kato Rabashanda. So we are going to read from uh, Luke, the Gospel of Luke 9. Glory to God. So Jesus, it says, now Jesus now called the 12 and gave them authority and power to deal with all demons and curse diseases. He commissioned them to preach the news of God's kingdom and to heal the sick. Mighty God, he said, don't load yourself up with equipment. Keep it simple. You are the equipment. Oh, Lord, you are the equipment. We're going to stay, keep it right there. Let's read it again. It said, now Jesus called the 12 and gave them authority and power to deal with all demons and curse diseases. He commissioned them to preach the news of God's kingdom and heal the sick. He said, don't load yourself up with equipment keep it simple you are the equipment oh god i just love the word of god when it backs ah uh, god if it even no matter how much years are days are days are weeks are hour how much minute i just love it when it confirms ah uh, god when it ties in oh jesus and you know that that he gave me uh, in previous that you are equipped for the battle Equipped for the battle because being equipped means that you are fully covered. You are the power in you. Oh, glory. You are the power. And this is what the scripture is saying. That guess what? You are the equipment. Oh, Jesus. You have all. Once you have on the armor. Once you are in Christ Jesus. You are mighty God, or of the sign and wonder anointing, Jesus, yes, Lord, you are of the dynamite power, oh, glory, the dynamite anointing, Jesus, I just love God, and I would encourage you to read the scripture on your own, that's the gospel of Luke, Luke chapter 9, glory to God, but I just read from, uh, uh, chapter one to maybe two where he's telling you that jesus called the 12 he gave them power and authority to deal with demons and curse diseases he commissioned them to preach the news of god kingdom and heal the sick and he said don't load yourself with equipment keep it simple because you are the equipment you are the power people of god mighty god so don't don't, mighty God, don't give up. Oh, Jesus, keep going. Don't stop. Keep going. Yes, Lord. We know that that's, that's it. The, the, the subtitle on the outside. Don't stop. Keep going. And this is why I want to encourage us today to don't stop and to keep going because it is written. Glory to God. It says that Jesus called the 12. And people of God, once you heard the voice and you give in, uh, God, and you obey and you have been baptized and you have received the spirit, the gift of the Holy Ghost, then you are called by God, Jesus. Then you are chosen by God. Oh, glory. So it means don't stop. Keep on going. Yes, Lord. Keep on going. The joy of the Lord is your strength. God is your deliverer, your way maker. Why? Because he has given, he gave to you the power and the authority. Oh, God. He gave to you the power and 
the authority. Knowing that you have the power and the authority, don't stop, beloved. Oh, Jesus. Keep on going. Oh, God. Don't stop. Don't you dare give up because you have been called and equipped. Jesus, you have been called and God have invested. He has poured in. He, he himself lives in you. Mighty God, he resides in you. This is Friday. This is a celebration day. Celebrate knowing that God is with you. He is in you. He's your fortress. He's your way maker. He's your deliverer. He's your present help in the time of trouble because he has called you and commissioned you to go. Yeah, God. Yeah, God. To go. Oh, He has called you and commissioned you to go. And when he called you and commissioned you to go, he has given you power yeah, God, and authority. And we know that even John confirmed this, what was said in Luke. Oh, God, the gospel of John said, beloved to many of you who believe and call on him, now you shall receive power and authority because you are sons of God. And being sons of God, you have power, oh, glory. Yeah, God. I don't know if you are feeling uh, the, this uh, confirmation, this excitement in your spirit as how oh, I am feeling it. Oh, glory to God. You are the equipment. You are the power. You Remember yesterday when it was revealed to me, you are that dynamite. You are that ticking bomb. You bring havoc to Satan, King's kingdom. Yeah, God. Yay. Ah, shatala bakuta. You are, you are the force to be reckoned, ah, God, with because you are of God and God is in you. Oh, God. So, therefore, no weapon. Oh, Jesus. Therefore, no weapon. Therefore, nothing by any means cannot arm you. It is coming up against you, but because God has gave you the power. He said that, listen, he has gave you power and the author authority and power to deal with all demons, no matter what shape, size, form, no matter what name, no matter what sound, no matter how it look, he has gave you, he has given you that power, oh God, that authority to deal with all demons, the S is on it, all demons and cure diseases. So no matter what the demons send on you, you are the power mighty God, to lay hands, to put hands, mighty God, even on yourself and the decree and the clear healing of God, because God is in you, oh glory, and you are of God, you are the power, you are the dunamite, you are the call, oh glory, you are the chosen, you are the anointed, you are the one that God has equipped with this power. Oh, glory to God. And being that he has equipped you with power, it says when you get this power, don't keep it to yourself. It says he commissioned them, mean he tell them, go preach it. Go tell others. Go encourage others. Go let them know, mighty God, that there is a God. Tell them about the kingdom of heaven, that it is at hand. Oh, glory to God. Yea, God. Tell them about God. Tell them about my glory. Tell them about my power. Oh, glory to God. You got to heal on your own now because there's going to come a time when I won't be among you anymore, but I'll be in you and I send you. But even though I'm there, I know that my spirit is with you. So I'm letting you practice. Go heal. Go teach. Go preach. Go tell others that I am. That I am. Oh God, that I am, that I am. 
go tell others that I am, that I am, Abashanda. I have power and I have commissioned you to go tell others about the kingdom of God. Go heal others. Go feed others. Go encourage others. Go tell them about your Savior. Go tell them that when they receive me, when they receive God, when they receive, oh God, your Savior, your Lord and Savior, they become fully equipped. Oh Jesus, they become fully aware Almighty God, and being fully aware, they now have the power that they need for to tear down every idol, to tear down every altar, to tear down everything that is coming up against, oh God, the kingdom of heaven, because you will be of the kingdom of light, mighty God. So therefore, everything that is against the kingdom of of light oh god you have the power oh god to destroy you have the power yeah god yeah jesus i told you that i won't belong oh mighty god but let us go ah uh, i want to think that that's why mighty god ah uh, god david have said in psalm 144 that lord jesus you gotta teach my hands yeah god he, he said bless is blessed be the lord my strength which teaches my hands to war and my fingers to fight so david understood the mandate that god is the one that has equipped him god is the one that has roped him god is the one that gave him strength god is the one that is with him mighty god that's why moses could say if you don't come i don't want to go mighty god because i understand when i have you i have everything when you are there i am fully equipped Oh, Jesus, when you are there, I have all the power. Yeah, God, when you are there, I know that I'm ready for this. I am called for this. I am chosen for this. Mighty God, when you are there, I know that I no, 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 I don't longer to say, oh, I need this because you will be it. Oh, Jesus, you will be it. You are the power. You are the fire. Oh, Jesus, whatever I need, you are mighty God. Whatever I need, you are because you have equipped me with authority and power. You have given me strength you have lifted my head round about my enemies you have pulled me up out of the many waters you have done it you are my strength you are my fortress you are my hiding place in your pavilion i take refuge in your feathers mighty god i know i am well covered in your company mighty god i know the enemy cannot touch me so, it said, don't load yourself. Don't go do anything. You don't need to spray on anything. You don't need to tie up anything. You don't need to put on anything. You don't need to do anything that is not of me because you are. Oh, God. It says, listen. Don't load yourself up with equipment. Keep it simple. Yes, Lord. You are the equipment. And no mighty God luxury in. In this warfare. Oh, God. I'm going to send you to some places. Mighty God. When you get back to your hometown, then now you will understand. Oh, God. That I've blessed you with that. But after that before but now where i'm gonna send you don't go into the luxurious inn 
don't go look for it. Don't go say, oh, I'm going to preach to the nice place. Go down in the valley, mighty God. Go down in some community. Encourage some people that everybody pass, mighty God. Feed some people that are hungry. The people that cannot feed you back. The people that cannot give you anything back more than they can and know that there is a God. Ah, God. And in coming to know that there is a God, they will say, truly, you are of God. Truly, you are from God because I don't understand. Everyone else passed me, but as for you, you did not. So I know I come to realize that there must be a God because you are doing the thing of God and praise be the name of God who have given you the strength, who have given you the authority, who has given you the power, who has equipped you to come down and feed me, mighty God. So it says that don't go, oh, don't go the, get to a modest place and be content there until you leave, mighty God. Don't go say, oh, I'm a woman of God, I'm a man of God. I have to go this and that. Everyone have to know that, hey, and you even shaking and there's no shaking. Oh God, you're shaking, but no power. You're speaking, but no understanding. You're speaking, but no wisdom. Mighty God, Eboshia. You're just making noise. But God is saying, beloved, that he has called you. He has given you the power. He has given you the authority. He has equipped you and been equipped. He has commissioned you. He has sent you out. He has sent you out, mighty God, to go tell others about the kingdom of God. Go teach, go preach, go heal. Oh, God. And in doing this, he said, he has given you power over all demons and curse diseases. Mighty God, when you wonder now, curse to cure all diseases, whatever disease want to come on you or come up on anyone once you are in Christ Jesus and Christ Jesus is in you is saying that you have the power you have the power oh glory to go you have the power to go heal you have the power to cure you have the power beloved to cure so don't stop don't let a little storm a little Oh, got a little hiccup in the way, a little stone, mighty God, a little face, a little hearsay, a little naysayer. Oh, God, stop you from doing the thing of God. Stop you from praying. Stop you from calling on the name of the Lord. Stop you from encouraging. Stop you from, obedi for be from being obedient to God. Don't let nothing on this earth mighty God, are things to come. Stop you from doing what God says because it is in his word. He said he has commissioned you. Go preach. Go tell others. Go. And when you're doing that, cure their diseases. Pray, mighty God. Remember that you are a dynamite. Remember that you are the ticking bomb. Remember that you are the sign and wonder. Remember that you have this anointing. And in having this anointing, is saying, don't give up. Because I am with you, mighty God. I'll be with you. I will not leave you nor forsake you. Glory to God. I am your present help. I am your mighty God, your right, oh God. I am the right hand that's going to uphold you, that I've been upholding you, that I've been keeping you, that I've been stabilizing you. I am your mouthpiece, oh God. I am your strength, oh God. I set your head, oh God, your forehead, oh God, strong against the adversary. So don't give up. Don't get weary. Don't stop. Keep on going. Keep on enduring. Endurance, mighty God, is the key. I pray you have the key of endurance. I pray you have the key of faith, oh God, to keep on going, of righteousness, of hope and salvation, to know that you have to fight for this, oh glory. 
you got to fight for this because this gospel that was given over to you, you got to fight for it. You got to endure for it. You got to equip for it because when you are called, when you are chosen, it's not going to be easy. But being that you are called, knowing that God is with you should give you all the faith, all the confidence, all the hope, all the belief, all the tenacity, everything that you need to know that God is with you and he will never leave you nor forsake you. He will never leave you comfortless. Yeah, God. And this is what the scripture is saying, that now I have given you the power, mighty God. I've given you this power. Oh God, because I have given you, oh God, the comforter, mighty God, the Holy Ghost, the Spirit. My Spirit lives in you, and my Spirit living in you, it means that you have the power and the authority. So I just stop by here to let you know that don't stop, keep on going, even when you feel like the power of God is not in you. He has said that it is in you. He has called you and commissioned you where you are. Some of you are waiting to, to, to go on the pulpit. He has commissioned you, oh God, for that job, in that workplace, in that car, in that supermarket, in that town, in that city, at that place. Commission you to go, encourage someone, tell someone, let let them know that God is coming back again, that he's alive and well. And even though, mighty God, they don't understand it, they don't see it, but let us pray still continually because there is a God. And he said, go tell others about my uh, gospel. Go tell others about my kingdom. Go tell others, uh, go preach, go feed, go heal, go deliver. The boss say, go lay hands on the sick. Go pray, go pray. Don't just go to church and leave. You have the power. You have the tenacity. You have the anointed. You have been called. You have been chosen. Don't stop. Keep on going. Hey, Shia. Don't stop. Keep on going because you have the power to heal the sick. Oh God, this is what the scripture says in gospel and the gospel of, of Luke 9. You have the power to heal the sick. Oh God, don't stop. Don't you dare get frustrated or under. Don't stop. Keep on going. Hey God, keep on going. Yeah, God, don't you dare stop. Oh, bashe keroi, kero baseke. Don't you dare stop. Don't you dare stop, beloved. Keep on going. It says that first you are going to be sent out. You're going to be sent out, oh God, to preach, mighty God, to nations, to preach, oh Jesus, to tell everyone that you have come in contact with of the goodness of Jesus. You got to tell them about the goodness of Jesus. You got to let them know what he has done for you and what he will uh, God do for them. Also, you, he said, listen, it's not no competition in the church. It should not be no competition against churches, against churches or competition in the church. It should be that you go out to get souls. It should be that you go out to do Abasheko Basaya is a will Yibashan de Korea. It should be that you have mighty God been sent out. Yeah, God, to do the will of God and for you to understand that you have been commissioned. You have been equipped. You have been called. You have been chosen. You have been sent. Almighty oh, God, it's for you to 
to know that this power that you have is not to show off and to say, oh, I can speak in tongues. I can and I can interpret tongues. I have the gift of this. I am the this and I am the that. I operate that and I operate this. No, beloved, it should not be for a show. Beloved, it should not be for a show. It should be that you go to the highway, to the byway, to the edges. You should go to the uttermost part of the earth. You should go in not in the luxurious place, but go in the place that people has been forgotten. Go to the place where know that when you're going, God is with you. Know that when you're going, he's your presence help. Know that when you're going, he will never leave you comfortless. Oh, glory to God. When you step out of your home, when you come out, you are expecting to go in. Mighty God, am I right? You are expected to go in. So when you step out, mighty God, step out with God. Tell others about God. When you go in the car, oh God, when you have even your own car and you see someone, mighty God, and you know, and the Holy Spirit is pricking you, oh, give them a lift. When you give them a lift, tell them about Jesus. Talk to them about the Messiah. Talk to them about the Savior. Glory to God. And when you're talking to them, you're not going to force it on them, but just encourage them. Uh, tell them about Jesus because Jesus is the one. Uh, the scripture says, One plant, one water, but the increase comes from God. God is the one that touched the heart, God is the one that make everything that is crooked straight. God is the one that, oh God, that heals. So even though we said you are to go and heal, He's the one that is in you, mighty God, but you got to abide in Him, you got to stay in Him. And when you abide in him, when you stay in him, glory to God, then now, glory to God, oh Jesus, then when you abide in him and stay in him, Jesus, then you have, you understand that the power and the authority will come to, to, to fully maturity, mighty God, that you, oh God, because the power, oh God, gives you understanding. The power gives you the knowledge. The power give you, mighty God, the anointing that you need. That's why I said that you are the equipment. Because that power is the equipment in you. That power, oh God, will lead you. That power will strengthen you. That power will clothe you. That power, oh God, will give you the strength that you need to go on. Beloved, think it not strange when you see all other things are happening. But you got to ensure that you remember at all times, the mandate, oh glory, you got to ensure that you are carrying out the mandate, Shiko, to go, oh Shia, and preach, go to nations, go to the atomous part, go Shia, because it said that you shall be witnesses. When this power come on you, you are going to be witness, witness to others. Tell them about this man Jesus and we know for the woman at the world she said to drop it she said come come see a man he have done this he have tell me this tell me is it not this the Christ glory to God so we know that Jesus is coming back again beloved don't stop whatever you're doing whatever situation that you are in or facing beloved Keep on going. It is not going to be easy, but with God, all things are possible. With God, you have the power. You have the authority because he has called you and gave it to you. I bless God today. I told you that I won't be long because I'm going over on the other platform in a few but I pray that you're encouraged. I pray that you have hear what the word of the Lord has said. And you, beloved, can read it on your own. I would encourage you, read all of the, the scripture. And when in reading it, then you'll get even an understanding. When most people say Moses, 
because he did not go over into the promised land. That's a total different sermon still. Uh, is not with Jesus, but scripture is going to tell you that when Jesus prayed, oh God, Moses and Elijah came down. Oh, glory to God. But I pray, beloved, that the Lord, you will know that you have been called and equipped, mighty God, for whatever you are facing, whatever you're going through. You are going through it, but it's not for you. Oh God, you're facing it only to overcome it, to tell others that they can endure also, to let others know that God is the one that has done it for you because he has been in you, oh God, and he can do it also for them. Let us pray. Spirit of a living God, we thank you, Lord, for all you have done and what you're about to do. We thank you that you're holy, you're righteous, you're omnipotent, you're good, and your mercies endure forever. God, we pray, God, for your people, for their heart, for their tenacity, oh God, to equip them, Lord God, until they understand that they are the power, they are the anointing, they are the authority. Oh God, they have it because you have called them and your God have equipped them with power, oh God, not only to trample up and serpent and scorpion, but God, to go to the atomous part of the the hurt to go into some desert place to go into some dry place and to clear and to proclaim that you are Christ and that you are coming back again. Hey, Shia, Spirit of the Living God, give them the endurance, give them the peace, give them the hope, give them the strength. And let God your will be done, and let your kingdom come. In Jesus' name, oh God, God bless you. God bless you and keep you and may his face continue to shine up on you. Now and to God that is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy to the only wise God or Savior, the glory and majesty, dominion and power, both now and forever. Amen. And amen. No one to God is able to do the exceedingly, the abundantly, the above all that you can ever ask of or think of according to the power that works within you. And remember, you have power. You have the authority. All you got to do is let it work within you. In Jesus' name. God bless you. God bless you. Smile a while and give your face a rest. Yes, yeah, smile a while. Thank you, woman of God. Smile a while and give your face a rest because this is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Love you too, woman of God. God bless you. I'm going over the other platform in a few. Uh, so God bless you as you continue to do the will of God as you continue to keep on going in God. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you.